Great pleasure to catch up with one of the stars of the Berwick Football Club. Kicked a great goal in the first quarter to get his team underway, Travis Tuck. Travis, just about the complete performance by the goal kicking. Yeah, it was good, I thought, by the boys, um, especially the forwards. It's sort of tough conditions, um, sort of wet one second and then the sun would come out and a bit crazy. But um, I thought overall we were, we were good, held them well. Do you think that they played into your hands a lot because you guys were happy to go the far side of the ground, which you did all day, and except a little bit in the last quarter, they just couldn't get it past that far side of the ground. I mean, you were happy to play it there all day, weren't you? Yeah, I think Nary liked to bring it through the middle a bit, and we sort of focused on that, covering that off a little bit, forced them wide, and, and with the wind that was going a bit, it was hard to hit targets, and especially out wide. And you know, We managed at times to, to be able to find that bloke in board and, and get that ball moving, so it was good effort. What about the defence? The defence just does the job all the time, doesn't it? Yeah, very solid six down there. And, yeah, once again today, the, the boys got the job done. It was very well done. But you go down there, not not just the the, uh, the six defenders, but when you don't have the ball, mm. the whole team's down there being a defensive team. And even when you've got the ball inside 50, you're defensive as well to keep it in there. Yeah, it's something we work on a hell of a lot at training and that sort of stuff with Stu, um, just getting that zone going and, and working together and making sure, you know, blokes behind each other are talking to each other to cover off and all that sort of stuff. So... Yeah, we do work as a team quite well in that defensive sense. And you go into the finals in great form. You've got Cranbourne next week. How do you feel about that? Uh, I mean, you would, I would say you're probably the most informed team in the comp at the moment, beating Nary, the top team at the right time. But uh, it couldn't be any better for you, could it? Yeah, it feels like we're really you know, hitting some momentum and that sort of stuff coming into the finals and really excited about you know, Cranbourne and the next opportunity to yeah, keep pushing forward with the momentum we have. Good on you, Travis. Thanks for joining us. Good luck in the finals. No doubt we'll chat again soon. Beauty. Thank you.